Have you been diagnosed with high cholesterol or have a family history of high cholesterol or heart disease? Have you experienced chest pain or are short of breath during normal activities? If you answered yes to any of these questions, this video is specially made for you. High cholesterol can be a silent killer, but the good news is you can take control and lower your cholesterol naturally. Let's find out how. Welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into a topic that's vital for your heart health the most effective way to lower your cholesterol naturally in seven days. Before we get started, let's hit that subscribe button below. Thanks for doing so. The most effective way to lower your cholesterol naturally in seven days. How bad cholesterol kills. First, let's talk about how bad cholesterol, specifically low-density lipoprotein, LDL, cholesterol can affect your health. LDL cholesterol is often referred to as bad cholesterol because it can lead to plaque buildup in your arteries. Over time, this plaque can harden and narrow your arteries, reducing blood flow and increasing the risk of heart attacks and strokes. High cholesterol levels can also cause other health problems such as 1. Peripheral artery disease, PAD 2. Chronic kidney disease, CKD 3. Reduced blood flow to the brain, increasing the risk of stroke Now that we understand the dangers, let's look at 5 effective methods to lower your cholesterol naturally. Method 1. Read those nutrition labels to avoid trans fats. Trans fats are one of the worst culprits when it comes to raising LDL cholesterol levels. These fats are often found in processed foods, baked goods, and margarine. By reading nutrition labels and avoiding trans fats, you can significantly lower your cholesterol. Reading nutrition labels is crucial for cholesterol management because it allows you to identify and avoid foods that are high in trans fats, which are known to raise LDL cholesterol levels. By being mindful of the ingredients and nutritional content of the foods you consume, you can make informed choices that will lower your cholesterol naturally and improve your heart health. Method two, choose meats with fewer saturated fats like fish or chicken. Saturated fats found in red meat and full fat dairy products can raise your LDL cholesterol. Opt for lean meats like fish and chicken. Fatty fish such as salmon and mackerel are especially good because they are high in omega-3 fatty acids, which can lower LDL cholesterol and raise high density lipoprotein, HDL the good cholesterol. Method three, get more soluble fiber with whole grain bread, kidney beans, quinoa, and more. Soluble fiber can help reduce the absorption of cholesterol into your bloodstream. Foods high in soluble fiber include whole grain bread, kidney beans, quinoa, oats, and barley. Incorporating these foods into your diet can help lower your LDL cholesterol levels. Soluble fiber forms a gel-like substance in the digestive tract that binds to cholesterol, preventing its absorption into the bloodstream. This gel also helps to remove cholesterol from the body by carrying it out through the digestive system. By incorporating foods high in soluble fiber into your diet, such as whole grain bread and kidney beans, you can effectively lower your LDL cholesterol levels. Eating soluble fiber is like giving your body a sponge to soak up the cholesterol and remove it before it has a chance to become a problem. Method four, boost unsaturated fats and fiber by snacking on fruits, vegetables, and nuts. Fruits, vegetables, and nuts are excellent sources of unsaturated fats and fiber. Unsaturated fats, such as those found in avocados, olive oil, and nuts, can help improve your cholesterol levels. Fiber helps reduce cholesterol absorption and promotes heart health. Eating fruits, vegetables, and nuts is similar to giving your engine an oil change. Unsaturated fats and fiber are like the new oil that keeps your motor running smoothly, while the old oil, which is high in saturated fats, is like sludge that clogs up your system. Method 5. Embrace low-fat milk, cheese, and yogurts. Dairy products can be high in saturated fats, but choosing low-fat or fat-free options can help you reduce your cholesterol intake. Low-fat milk, cheese, and yogurts are great alternatives that provide essential nutrients without the added cholesterol. Regular dairy products such as whole milk, cheese, and yogurts tend to have higher levels of saturated fats, which can increase LDL cholesterol levels. On the other hand, opting for low-fat or fat-free alternatives can help you reduce your saturated fat intake while still providing essential nutrients. Choosing low-fat dairy options is like making a healthier choice for your heart by cutting out the excess saturated fats found in regular dairy products. The most effective method, get more soluble fiber. While all these methods are beneficial, the most effective way to lower your cholesterol naturally in just seven days is by increasing your intake of soluble fiber. Here's why. Advantages of soluble fiber. Number one, it reduces cholesterol absorption. Soluble fiber binds to cholesterol in your digestive system and helps remove it from your body. Multiple studies have shown that increasing soluble fiber intake can effectively lower LDL cholesterol levels. For example, 
A study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition found that consuming 3 grams of soluble fiber per day resulted in a 3.7% reduction in LDL cholesterol levels. Another study published in the Journal of the American Medical Association, JAMA, found that a high-fiber diet, including soluble fiber, led to a significant reduction in LDL cholesterol levels compared to a low-fiber diet. Number two, it supports weight management. High-fiber foods are more filling, helping you manage your weight, which is crucial for heart health. Some examples of high-fiber foods that are rich in soluble fiber include oats, barley, lentils, beans, peas, apples, oranges, strawberries, and carrots. These foods not only help to reduce cholesterol absorption, but also support weight management, making them excellent choices for maintaining a healthy heart. Number three, stabilizes blood sugar levels. Soluble fiber can slow the absorption of sugar, helping to control blood sugar levels and reduce the risk of type 2 diabetes. Soluble fiber forms a gel-like substance when it dissolves in water, which slows down the digestion and absorption of carbohydrates. This in turn slows the release of sugar into the bloodstream, helping to stabilize blood sugar levels. By regulating the rate at which sugar is absorbed, soluble fiber can reduce the risk of spikes in blood sugar and the development of type 2 diabetes. Some of the shortcomings of other methods are as follows. On avoiding trans fats, while essential, it's more about eliminating a negative rather than adding a positive. One, trans fats are a major source of unhealthy cholesterol and should be avoided. One, however, other methods like eating more fruits and vegetables, exercising regularly, and maintaining a healthy weight are also important for overall health. Choosing lean meats, beneficial, but it doesn't have as immediate an impact as soluble fiber. While avoiding trans fats is crucial for reducing unhealthy cholesterol levels, choosing lean meats may not have an immediate impact on cholesterol. However, incorporating both methods into a healthy lifestyle, along with eating more fruits and vegetables, exercising regularly and maintaining a healthy weight, can collectively contribute to improved overall health and cholesterol management. Two, boosting unsaturated fats, great for overall health but requires a balanced intake to avoid excess calories. Two, in contrast to the immediate impact of incorporating soluble fiber, choosing lean meats may not have an immediate effect on cholesterol levels. Three, however, both methods, along with eating more fruits and vegetables, exercising regularly and maintaining a healthy weight, can collectively contribute to improved overall health and cholesterol management. Four, low-fat dairy, important but more of a supporting role in the overall diet. Four, on the other hand, some people argue that low-fat dairy is not as important as other dietary changes. Four, they argue that low-fat dairy is a relatively minor player in the overall cholesterol management game. Symptoms of high cholesterol. High cholesterol often has no symptoms until it's too late. That's why regular checkups are essential. However, some warning signs can include one, angina, chest pain, two, extreme fatigue, five, shortness of breath, four, numbness or coldness in your extremities. Factors that cause high cholesterol. Several factors can increase your risk of high cholesterol, including one, poor diet, high in saturated and trans fats, two, lack of physical activity, three, smoking, or obesity, five, age, risk increases as you get older, six, family history of high cholesterol, getting a proper diagnosis. To properly diagnose and manage high cholesterol, follow these steps. One, consult a healthcare professional. Discuss your concerns and symptoms with your doctor. One, they may recommend lifestyle changes, such as exercising regularly and eating a healthy diet. One, they may also prescribe medication to help lower your cholesterol. Two, blood tests get a lipid panel test to measure your cholesterol levels. Three, lifestyle review. Discuss your diet, physical activity, and other lifestyle factors with your doctor. Four, home monitoring. Monitor your cholesterol levels at home with home test kits. Five, medication. Ask your doctor about medications that can help reduce your cholesterol levels. Exercise. Regular exercise can help reduce cholesterol levels. Six, eating healthy. Eating a balanced diet with plenty of fruits and vegetables can also help lower your cholesterol levels. Seven, stay hydrated. Drinking plenty of water is crucial for overall health and can help manage cholesterol levels. We hope these tips help you manage your cholesterol better. Remember, small daily habits can make a big difference. Now that you have this valuable information, it's time to take action. Try incorporating more soluble fiber into your diet for the next seven days and observe the changes in your cholesterol levels. Have you tried any of these methods before? Which one worked best for you? Share your experiences in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends and family. 
And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more health tips and updates. Hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. In summary, managing your cholesterol naturally is entirely possible with the right dietary changes. By focusing on increasing your intake of soluble fiber, you can make a significant impact on your cholesterol levels and overall heart health in just seven days. Thank you for watching. Stay informed, stay healthy, and see you in the next video. Take care. Until next time, take care and be well.